Police in Australia have arrested a man suspected of acting as an economic agent for North Korea. They say there is evidence that suspect has been in contact with high-ranking officials in North Korea. Our Park Soyan reports. Local authorities identified the suspect as a 59-year-old naturalized Australian man originally from South Korea. They say Che Chun Han was a low-level hospital worker who had been living alone in Sydney. Has been charged with brokering sales of missiles, missile components, and expertise from North Korea, as well as discussing the supply of weapons of mass destruction. Che is said to have been working for the North Korean government since at least 2008. Police also say Che attempted to transfer coal from North Korea to non-government entities in Vietnam and Indonesia. A high-ranking police official said he had never seen such a case in Australia. He said that if successful, the various trades could have amounted to tens of millions of dollars. We think he's, an, he's acting as a, basically as an economic agent on behalf of North Korea. There's nothing to suggest he's doing anything but that. He's doing it out of a patriotic purpose, and I think it does go to show that the sanctions are biting.、Um, the fact that we've got people involved in these type of activities、um, means means that I think the sanctions are actually ha- having some effect. Australian Prime Minister Malcolm Turnbull also responded to the arrest. North Korea is a dangerous, reckless, criminal regime threatening the peace of the region. It is vitally important that all nations work relentlessly to enforce those sanctions, because the more economic pressure that can be brought on North Korea, the sooner will that regime will be brought to its senses. Che could face up to 10 years behind bars if convicted and has been denied bail. Park Soyeon, Arirang News.